And now to a developing story. Milwaukee police shot and killed a man at a veteran's home this morning. As Fox 6's Bill Miston has learned, the man was a veteran and a longtime resident. Bill? Mary and Ted, police say they were called to Vets Place Central for an active shooter this morning. Vets Place Central provides transitional housing as well as uh, long-term housing for veterans. The organization that runs the programs says it's hard to believe that something like this happened. It's a tragic event. It's nothing we would ever woke up this morning and expected to happen. At around 7.30 Tuesday morning, police say they got a call for an active shooter at Vets Place Central. We have a report being that there was individuals who uh, were in close proximity of the individual who had fired his weapon. Police say the 66-year-old man was in the basement along with other residents and that the man pointed the gun at the two officers who were first inside and that the man pointed the gun at the two officers who showed up and one of the officers shot the man and killed him. No one else was hurt. For hours, police had the blocks surrounding the facility closed off as investigators worked to piece together what happened. Chief Jeffrey Norman says the bomb squad was on hand in case they found explosives. Norman didn't say if they found anything. He was a longtime resident and he was uh, a member of the SRO permanent housing program. Vets Place Central provides permanent and transitional housing for veterans. It's run by the Center for Veterans Issues. Jason Johns is a veteran and the organization's attorney. Johns wouldn't get into details about the man's background or what started the situation, but he says some veterans have difficulty transitioning back into civilian life, and that's where CVI comes in. We're all brothers. We all served in combat together, uh, whether it's the same generation or not, and we at CVI are a family. Johns says counselors with the Department of Veterans Affairs are on hand to talk with residents and employees. Milwaukee police say the officer who shot the man is 38 years old and has been with the department for nearly two decades. He's been placed on administrative duty, which is routine in these types of situations. The Oak Creek Police Department is leading the investigation as the outside investigation continues. Reporting live in Milwaukee, Bill Miston, Fox 6 News. All right, Bill, thank you.